They did. Well, they just get cut down. Yes. My hammer unit has now fallen. That's very sad. I mean, I We've... feel like I took more damage in my own face than I did to you. But... Welcome to heresy, George. Welcome to heresy. Right, three two up armor saves. You lose a Terminator. Can we just not? Can we, can we go back to the last game, please? What last just... game? This is the only game we've ever played. <laughs> George, thank you for introducing me to heresy. I love this game. Why, why you do this? <laughs> Come on, oh, point. Oh, no, what shame. Oh, oh, Mikey, where are your command for? Oh, wait, they, they don't exist. Bugger. Hey guys, my name is Mikey, and today I'm going to be running the Iron Hand. I'm using everything from the box set minus 10 Marines because they're still unbuilt inside the Spartan. Just quickly before you start this video, do you want to win this? Okay, well, if you want to win 10 Mark 6 Beaker Marines that are found inside my Spartan, just comment they're inside the Spartan and leave a like on this video. You'll be ended to win 10 brand new Mark 6 Beaker Marines. So leave a comment that says they're in the Spartan. That's the code word, the secret. Also, if you would like to enter another giveaway in our Discord for members only, we're currently giving away a Kratos battle tank for anyone who reacts to this post in Discord throughout June. So all you have to do is become a member for as little as $1.99 today. Join the Discord, react to this post, and you could win a Kratos battle tank as well. That's it. Win some Beaky Marines, comment, they're inside the Spartan. Also, like the video. Win a Kratos battle tank, join the Discord, and react to the post. All right, go enjoy the game. So because I'm playing Iron Hands, I get the Medusa scales. So I reduce the strength of incoming weapons against my infantry dreadnoughts and stuff by one. George's bolters are going to be strength three rather than four, which is really <laughs> nice. And then anything that is a vehicle, instead of getting minus one strength to range attacks, they get it will not die. So they start to heal wounds at the end, the start of every turn, which is really cool. So that Spartan is going to try and stay around for a lot longer than it should, especially with a Ford Lord, which we'll get into. First up, leading my army, I'm going to be using a Legion Praetor with a Paragon Blade. He's also equipped with a Volkite Charger. Because he's my Warlord, he's going to be taking the Warlord trait Silver Iron Will. Because obviously it's Iron Hands though, everything is Iron Base. So basically I can't react during the movement phase, but I can react twice in either the shooting or the assault phase whilst he's alive. I've got a Legion Centurion equipped with a Power Act. He's going to be upgraded to a Legion Forge Lord so he can start to heal vehicles in the shooting phase, which is really cool. And he's also equipped with a Cyber Familiar, so he gets plus one to his invulnerable save to a four plus. In the troops, I've got three tactical squads, three Legion tactical squads of 10. They're all pretty much the same. They've got a couple of upgrades. I've got a power sword on one of the sergeants. I've got a lightning claw on another sergeant. I've got a power fist on the third sergeant. And they've all got plasma pistols. In the elites, I've got a cataphracti squad, all with double lightning claws for all those extra attacks and all that shreddy goodness. And they've got a grenade harness as well, so they don't suffer the initiative penalty for charging through terrain. The other squad of cataphracti all have chain fists and combi bolters which are really good at like taking down tanks and dreadnoughts and stuff. They just like, they, they, they get some, don't they? Oh, they try. <laughs> and they've also got a grenade hardness on there as well. I've got a Contempt of Talon of one with a Gravis auto cannon, a Gravis fist and a Gravis bolt gun thing in the fist. <laughs> Gravis no, ten, 10 out of 10 would Gravis fist again. Right. And finally, I've got a Land Raider Spartan, which is like my transport. It's the big chungus. It's the big chunky boy. It's got a bunch of last cannons. It's got some heavy bolters. And it's also got a multi-melter to boot. So that's my list. We're only playing 1750 points because I'm only using the starter box. So let's go and have a look at the Empress Children and Sons of Horus. Hi, guys. I'm George. And today I'm going to be running Empress Children and Sons of Horus. My Legion trait for the Empress Children means that on a charge, I get plus one initiative. So I'll be attacking before Mikey will do if I get the charge off first. And as for the Sons of Horus, I reduce uh, the strength of your attacks in combat by one. Starting off, I have Lucius the Eternal, who at this point in the Heresy is just Lucius the Swordsman. He's going to be my Warlord. We also have two tactical squads. Both of them have Artificer Armor, and both of them have a Power Weapon. One, however, is upgraded to have a Phoenix Power Spear. The other one has a Power Sword, both of which have a Legion Vexilla as well, which should help them out in combat. I've also gone for a squad of Terminators in Tartarus armor. So a little bit different to Mikey's, they'll be a bit faster. The squad has four Lightning Claws, a Vexilla as well. They have Combi Bolters, a Chain Fist, and a Plasma Blaster, just to give them a little bit of that extra anti infantry punch. So I also have Ancient Rylanor, but from Wish. There's just a Contempt of Dreadnought Talon of one, which is you know, the loneliest number. But he should be doing some damage. He's got a Kerry's Assault Cannon, 
and a flamer in his fist. I also have a javelin speeder with two las cannons and a multi melter which should give me a little bit more anti-armor punch, hopefully. I've also got a unit of palatine blades to follow Lucius around, which should be good and should be very choppy. So I've got a power spit on the sergeant. I've given them phoenix power blade, power sabers, on the regular marines, so that they should have a little bit of rending attacks in there to hopefully slice and dice some of Mikey's more elite units. I also have a Sons of Horus allied detachment, which is led by a chaplain with a jump pack and a Karsaram power axe, which is just a replacement power act, um, which is not unwieldy, is AP3, so it'll go against marines, but on wound roll of a 5 up, it's AP2 as well, so should be able to go through some artificer armor there as well. Uh, he's going to be part of a 10-man assault squad, which is going to be my troop choice for the allied detachment, and backing them up, I'm going to have two grav cannons on rapiers, which should give me some interesting haywire attacks as well against the vehicles. So let's go... <laughs> <laughs> It's time to do. <laughs> Today the players are playing Dominion, which is mission four from the core rulebook. In this mission, the players place five objectives and they'll be deploying in a Dawn of War deployment. The primary objective in this mission is Dominion objectives. At the start of each player's active turn, they score one victory point for each objective they control. The secondary objectives in this mission are Slay the Warlord for an extra D3 points if they kill the Warlord. They also get D3 points if they kill more enemy units at the end of the game. The mission's special rules include reserves, night fighting and dominion objectives. These objectives must be placed more than 6 inches away from each other, a board edge and outside of the deployment zone. Whoever deploys their army first gets to take the first turn, but the opposing player can seize the initiative by rolling a stick. So let's get into the game. And we are deployed! The legendary, the boys, the iron will, the boys, the iron legends, the iron iron legend, the iron boys have deployed. So we have Warlord Will Smith. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Get my my Primarch's name out of your. Primarch can't have a name if you don't have a head. <laughs> very good, very good. But I'm joined by the lovely George. Hi, George. Hello. We are playing Iron Hands versus Empress Children and Sons of Forest. Backing them up, here in my hand. Yep. I like to think. Look, I'm, I'm an, an iron hand. No, that my I'll, I'll, I'll leave now. Get out. <laughs> I like to think this is like an old imperial fortress that's been overtaken by the Empress Children and the Sons of Horus, and the Iron Hands are like, you killed my dad. Like, it's band 5.5. .5. Yeah, exactly. It's narrative. Yeah, fluff. Exactly. So we're playing Dominion in this game, so we place five objectives. Each objective is worth a point, and then we have to kill the Warlord for an extra point and stuff like that. Yep. You deployed first. You're going first. Lucius is coming for you. Are you ready? I am ready. You ready for me to seize the initiative? I am. Here we go. Fight me. If I roll six, I steal the turn. Oh no. Yeet! I've rolled a six, George. Oh no, my dice is broken. <laughs> so let's go into Iron Hands, then one. Okay, in the movement phase, we've moved on to this objective here by moving seven, and the Dreadnought's gone to back them up. Uh, this unit and this unit have disembarked from the Spartan and, and jumped onto these two objectives. Go this one. These guys have run, but they didn't really use it much. And then these guys have just moved forwards as well. And that's it. You, you couldn't react. I I can't react. I'm just speechless to this. Just actually speechless. I'm actually speechless. Apart from, you know, this Fast and Furious is Van Drift. But... <laughs> Are you going to shoot in phase? Yeah. Go into it. You, you seem to have like a thing against my Terminator. Is it my key? Okay, so the Spartan is going to open fire because I have a sponsor, this Laz Cannon, this Pintle Mounted Multi Melter, and the Heavy Bolt is going to shoot straight forward into the. Terminators and this Spartan is going to shoot the wall, and by that I mean do nothing. Yep. So here we go. I have a, tw a last cannon array, so it hits on threes, but it's night fighting. So yep. we're minus on ballistic skill. I can only target within 24, otherwise, I'd be shooting them rapiers and the missile launchers. Yep, and you didn't pay for a searchlight. I did not. So threes to hit, fours to hit, but re rolling because of twin linked. So two hits, nice. and it's twos to wound. Yep. So double your toughness. There's two wounds. Two wounds, and these will be instant death, and they do go straight through my armor, but they do have an invent save of five up. So there's one, one dead. Just dies. Because they have two wounds for instant death. I've got a multi melter, which is re rolling. No hit. And then I've got the heavy bolter. Re rolling. That one did hit. And it's done five, so threes. It just. Stop it, Mikey. Just stop Does moving my mind. Stop rolling stuff. No, not with heavy balls. Don't think so. Cool. No rending. Two wins then. Two ups. And Loves it. All right, that's that unit done. So these two cataphracts, I've mm. shot their bolters over and managed to kill one marine from this unit. 
These Marines are going to do exactly the same with their bolters, the 24 inch range. So hitting on fours because it's dark air and one wound. One hour one save. Entire wound. Loves it. And he's fine. All right, cool. And we're going to do exactly the same over here. Then they managed to kill two and the Dreadnought ended up shooting there as well and did nothing because if I shot this guy, he'd be able to react and shoot straight back, which I don't want. So that's the end of the shooting phase. You've got morale check to do because it's the end of every phase. I do. I have one morale check with my Terminators, which is two dice. And uh, that is absolutely fine because they would have failed if it would have been over an eight. Yeah, so, wicked. At least I'm right. not running away. Yeah. Um, I don't have any charges. I think that's in my turn. Yep, that's, that's absolutely easy. fine by me. All right, cool. So without further ado, let's go into the Naughty Boys. Take one. So in the movement phase, the Emperor's children have advanced slowly onto this objective and making their way forward. Lucius and his boys have moved up and the Dreadnought and his friends have moved and they've stayed still, yeah? Yep, these guys are staying still because... Um, yeah, I'm not going to try and try and like hit you with a rocket launcher, really. Funnily Just enough. Funnily enough. Yeah. Um, I can't react to the movement phase because of my warlord trait. That's now it's the me. shooting phase. High plate phase. So the graviton cannons are going to fire into the Sparta, and here we go. Uh, and that is a direct that's hit. That's a direct hit because of scattered it's dice. There. Yep. Uh, just as well because... If that, yeah. that would have missed. <laughs> and the second one. Uh, uh, minus uh, four to four inches. Inch Yep, so we'll still hit you. So clips twice. This is haywire, right? Yep, this is haywire. So you're looking for a two or more so for glancing, and then a six is a ten. Two plus. So that's two, two glances. glancing hit. So he's down to four. The missile launchers are going to do exactly the same. Here we go. We're going for Spartan bullying time. So, so we're hitting on threes. Hitting on fours because it's very dark, George. You are? That is correct. So they one hit. One hit. So I'm looking for a eight. six. I'm about you 14, so I'm Ooh. a six. Oof. That's a shame. That's a shame. I think I'm going to go for the Dreadnought here. I think I'm going to try and get rid of some of them Lightning Claws. Though. Okay, cool. So because of the Medusa Scales, because I'm an Iron Hand, we reduce the strength of your weapon by one. So that's fine. I hit on twos normally. Because of mm -hmm. Night Fighting, I'm going to be hitting on threes. Yep. That's two hits. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> and normally I'd be wounding you on twos, but because I'm reducing the strength by one, it goes down and to threes. threes. But they are rending. So they are AP2. So I'll go so straight through your armour, but so you're Cataphract. I've got a Cataphract. So four plus in one. One's got. One dead. That's what I like to see. Alright. So we've got some bolters into these guys as well. And I'm also going to declare Fury of the Legion. Okay. Because I'm probably going to charge you next turn or you're going to charge me. Okay. So I may as well try and make use of the rule. Fire my guns, in essence, twice, but I won't be able to use them next turn. Cool. Reloading. So I'll react and I'll evade this because I'm super... I've got big claws that I can dodge. Big, like big claws, yeah. So it's I, just I that get... you can't see me. Yep. So I ignore <laughs> damage on a fire now. Yep, that's for this reaction. Okay. So hit on fours. So hit on fours, which is a little bit annoying, but not the end of the world here, apparently. Now, the only problem here is bolt is strength four. Become strength three. Your toughness four. That comes strength three. Five's to wound. So five's to wound. Right, it's a single wound. Maybe I didn't need to react One. to this. One, two up. I did not need to react. <laughs> annoying. Ouch. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's so fair they enough. can't shoot their bolters next day because they shot them twice. Nope, but well, they do have bolt pistols, so yeah, they cool. can still use them. So we shot uh, Lucius's pimp squad and they did nothing, but this unit is going to be shooting. Who do, who do you want to shoot? So these guys are going to be shooting the Cataphracty Terminators that are in here. Cool. Uh, so we have three combi bolters, mm -hmm. so they get two shots each, hitting on fours, but they are twin linked, so it means they get to re-roll. Yeah. So they all hit fives, because again, you have that beautiful Woo! iron hand rule, so I only get two wounds. Two tops. All good. Great. Now here's the good thing though. I've it's got plasma, plasma blaster. Here we go. So they don't get hot. They do not get both hot. Hit. Both hit. And we get two wounds. Two so wounds. It's strength seven, goes to six, but that's still wounding on twos. Yeah. So. And does the four do anything? Um, the four goes to an AP two as well. So that will be going straight through your armor. Cool. All right. So I'll do the armor save, which passes. And then I'll do the invulnerable save from the explosion one. No, yep. so, so that's wound. one wound. So I'll put a wound on this guy. At Look, Mar, I did something. Okay, we've got the javelin over here now. What's he going to shoot? So the javelin's going to be shooting at the dreadnought. Okay. So I'm guessing you're going to react and shoot back. Yes, because of silver iron will, very sparkly iron will, I can react twice either, either the shooting on the assault phase. Yep. I'll react twice now and I'll return fire. Uh, amazing that. Uh, what, what a surprise. I didn't know that's what Mike was waiting <laughs> for. So I've got a multi melter and two las cannons. So cool. here's the two las cannons. Sure. So force to hit. So nothing. And a multi-melter. But the multi-melters are now twin linked. Yep. So it hits. You hit. And it wounds. It wounds. Okay. So I have an invulnerable save of five plus. That's annoying. I'll take a wound. Yep. Um, okay. So I will return fire. Right. We're going to shoot back with the Gravis auto cannon. So it's three shots. that they These are twin linked. Just as well. 
two hits. Next strength seven, your toughness. Toughness is also seven. Okay, so fours to wound. Oh, sorry, toughness is six on the javelin. Oh, threes then, right, looking for sixes. So two wounds, two saves. Yep, AP two, four. three up saves. Six wounds. a wound, down to three. Excellent. Okay, we shot some bolt pistols into here, but we didn't do anything. The reason we shot bolt pistols is because you're going to charge 11 inch. Going to go for an 11 inch charge. Go here. for it. Ready? Here we go. Ready? I'm ready. That was no. not, that's a seven. Yeah, that's. It's so not that's a seven, 11, George. Not, not the perfect charge I was going for. No, terrible. All right. <sighs> So we've got another charge here. This was a nine inch charge. Into these guys. Fail. Sad. Can, can, can you not? Just, Very sad. Um, I will better. Overwatch. Sure. I may as well. It's free real estate. Let's just double check I can actually Overwatch even if you fail the charge. Yeah, that's fine. So whether the charge is successful or not, I can Overwatch. And because I've got Silver Iron Will, I can see in the dark. Yeah. So I ignore right. modifiers. So hitting on threes. We roll in. Pause. Nice, three wounds. Are you ready? You take a wound. Ah, great. I take a wound. <laughs> <laughs> All right, any more charges? Um, but I think I'm going to stop while I'm... I would say I'll stop while I'm ahead, but I'm not even at this point. No, so. no I don't think so. Yes. Uh, I've got to do morale over here. Shame. I failed. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> so they're going to move four inches directly backwards. They're running away. My morale, I, need, I need my whippy stick. <laughs> and um, you didn't kill anyone else. So that's the end of your turn. Yeah, that's, that's the end turn, of turn one. That's turn one. Very quick. Yeah, that's actually pretty quick, to be honest. Mm. So. Not a lot happened. You did a wound. I mean, I We've... feel like I took more damage in my own face than I did to you. But... Welcome to heresy, George. Welcome to heresy. Yes. Right, because I'm an iron hand, this doesn't reduce strength of weapons, but it does get, it will not die. Which it does not die on a fight, so on a six plus it gets a wound. Can, can you not? Can you just... What happened to your dice from the last game, Mikey? <laughs> just, just, why? Well, I'll let you roll the dice now. Is it still dark? Is the night fighting in effect? Cocked. On a four up. No. The no. lights are on. What a shame. What a shame. Now I can actually shoot you properly. Yeah, but it means I can probably shoot you properly now as well. Can we? we no, we just... Oh no. Just, Oh, skip no. over that. Let's go tie in hands turn two. So over here we've consolidated towards the objective. We've left a gap for the dreadnought and you did withdraw with the I did. with your uh, tactical marines. It is called a tactical retreat. It's not withdrawing really, you know. We don't we don't <laughs> we don't do that falling back. Not in No, none of that, none of that. Uh these guys have stayed still. They're just they've just basically they keep falling over, so we're just leaving them there. Yeah, but they're holding fine. that objective. The Spartan has moved, uh, the Terminators have come out of the terrain. These guys have consolidated here, and this guy is the Forge Lord, so on a 3+, plus, he's going to heal a 4+, plus, uh, sorry. Four plus. He does not. Okay, so that's instead of him shooting. Yeah, a bit of a Forge Lad. <laughs> yeah, and these guys have regrouped, but they can just move, they can't. They can shoot, yeah, they, they move their charge. initiative. Yeah, but they can't charge this turn, yeah. which is a big thing. So that's it for the movement phase, let's go into shooting. So the Spartan is going to shoot, and because he has power of the machine spirit, he can shoot multiple targets. Yay, it's like 40k, it's fire. great. <laughs> So this twin link last cannon and the heavy bolter are going to go into these, this unit. Yep. Uh, the multi melter and this twin link last cannon is going to go into the dread. My poor dreadnought. Would you like to react? Um, honestly, there's not really that much point in me doing anything here because I don't have any guns that can hurt the Spartan. So True. There's no point in turning fire. Okay, so we'll do the last cannons first. Mm -hmm. um, you know, the last cannon is going to go into the terminators instead. Okay. Yeah. So last cannon terminators, <clears throat> heavy bolter there. Last kind of multi melt into there. Would you like to react with this unit instead? No, because again I have a plasma blaster which isn't enough to actually get through your armor. Okay, so we'll do we'll do the twin link last cannon. Yep. Both here. Both wound. Two invulnerables. And two invulnerables. Um, uh, one make one, but one dies. We've got the heavy bolter with twin links. That's three hits. It's strength five. Yep, toughness four. So two wounds. Two wounds. Takes a wound. One goes. Actually, no, they have two wounds, sorry, because they, they have, have two palatine wounds. blades. Yes, they're fancy there we boys. Uh, we got the last cannon into the Dreadnought. Both hit. Now, you're not a vehicle, so Sunder does nothing, which is very annoying. It's annoying, but it, it also has two bonuses. Wounds. Two wounds. It takes, so it wound. takes one, because he has a two up armor save. Cool. All right, then we've got the multi melter, which hits. And doesn't wound. Nope. But Armour Bane has to be within half Armour range? Armour Bane has to be in half range because it has the melter bit attached to it. Bugger. Yeah. Okay, that fails. So the benefit of Dreadnoughts now being not vehicles is that bolters can actually wound them. So, mm -hmm. swings and roundabouts. Swings and roundabouts. 
The Terminators are going to rapid fire into the Terminators. And they got combi bolters, so three to rolling. Isn't this nice, Mikey, without all of this stratagem rubbish? Oh, yeah, it's great. Uh, that is three wounds. Right, three two up armor saves. You lose a Terminator. That's a double one, George. Can, can, we, can we just not? Can we, can we go back to the last game, please? What last just... game? This is the only game we've ever played. <laughs> <laughs> the Volkite Charger is going to shoot the Terminators as well. Two hits. And just... Your bendy, just your bendy, bendy sword is catching my dice. <laughs> All right, leave my Forge World stuff alone. Doesn't wound. Okay. Um, Four drugs, sort your shit out. Yeah, I think we'll just shoot some pop shot bolters as well. So these guys shot into the Palatines, as did this unit, and we didn't manage to do anything. Like me. And then over here, we shot with bolt pistols, and the plasma pistol exploded and killed him. That was fun, because I failed my save. You had one job, and I'm not even angry about it, so... No. Now I've got the Dreadnought. What's the charge range of the Javelin? Uh, Too much. Probably too much. Because you'll have to go around the squad. Yeah. So, and through difficult, so that's gonna be okay. that, that's a no from me, Chef. Yeah. Okay, so I'll shoot the uh, I'll shoot the unit with the auto cannon. We roll it. <clears throat> uh all hit with BST. Yep. And strength seven, so threes. Yep, three to wound. One wound that's rendered. Ooh, so that'll go straight through. Sure does. So two wounds left on the javelin. No into the unit, not on the javelin. Oh sorry. It's okay. Because I can't I can't shoot the I can't shoot what I've got to charge what I shoot, George. That's yes, what I'm trying to say. Sorry. All right. Bolters. Two hits. One wound. Fine. Okay. Cool. Funny fact about this javelin. Somehow that's cavalry. Yeah. Very odd. No, I mean, I, I like it having wounds and everything instead of being a vehicle because it went from two whole points to four wounds. Mm. But how is it cavalry? I guess it's carrying the two dudes. It's fine. Look at me in my robot would like, horse. Would you like to react? Um, this is my no. last unit to shoot. Your last one to you shoot. May as well. I may as well. We'll do it and see what happens. It's free wheel estate. Okay, so you elected to return fire because it's my last unit, but you're only strength three, and I'm a dreadnought, which means reduce your scales. And your iron hand, so... So it's strength three, so you can't wound top to seven. Great. Right, we've got charge phase then. We're going to charge the unit first into here. Would you like to react? Um, I think I'll overwatch. Okay, go for it. We'll do the overwatch and we'll tell you what happens. He did manage to kill one in overwatch, but we got charge. It's nine inch. I think I'm probably Ooh, all right. We're probably going to be all right there. Because you're gonna... not touching the train. So. No, that's the point. That's why they're like Kongolite yeah. Brown. Then I'm going to try and charge the Dreadnought. So the Iron Hands have charged there. So we're going to try and charge the Dreadnought. He's looking for a nine. Please, please no. Fuck. Come on, oh, point. Oh, no. What a shame. Oh, uh, uh, Mikey, uh, where are your command? Oh, wait. They, they don't exist. Bagger. So we just Surge moved up there. So he's moved half the distance just to get a little bit closer. And now we're going to charge here into those Terminators. But parry this, you casual. <laughs> so you need your advanced reaction? <laughs> so I'm going to use my advanced reaction, which basically means me and Mikey are going to roll off. And do a roll off the charge. charge. If yeah. he makes the charge. Fine. Fine. If I beat him and can make the charge distance here, then I'll get to charge him. If I don't, then I'll get to fire. Yeah. So. Okay. Well, good luck. Here we go. So I rolled the six. You also, also rolled, rolled the six. six. So, do, so what's it, what happens if there's a tie? We'll find out no, and I'll I see if know. I make the charge. So, six inches does make the charge. However, because you're going through terrain and you're just over six inches, you failed the charge. If you made the charge, you'd be able to cancel my charge and charge in return. Yes. But because you can't make the charge, you can't cancel my charge, but you get to shoot instead. I get to shoot. So it's like free, free overwatch, I guess. Yeah, exactly. So this is just some bolt pistols. Bolt. Uh, they are ballistic still five. Um, so that is going to be three wounds because you're reducing my strength by one. Sure am, so three and two ups. Lucius uh, has a bolt pistol, which hits and also wounds. So one more, please. Passed. Damn it. And cool. now you actually make it into Now I make the charge. You just make six there. I should have done it with the Terminators, to be honest, but oh well. Yeah, I guess with the advanced reaction, it's kind of like an overwatch if better. Yeah. So you always be able to shoot, which is nice. The only thing is, would have been a bigger squad with the Palatines, and they also have like Rending Swords and Lucius. So. Yeah, for sure. All right, cool. Uh, I have no other charges. Let's go in the combat phase. Yep. Or oh, the assault. Phase. We're in the assault phase already. The Let's go into the fighty bit. Phase. The fighty step. The wappy sticks phase. Okay, so we got combat over here. We both initially force. We strike at the same time. Yep. I have uh, five of them making a charge move. So ten attacks hitting on fours and wounding on fours. That is three wounds, sir. So three, three up armor saves. And one. Oh, actually, I'm wounding on three. Sorry, because I have a bayonet. So one more save. And one more. Doesn't make a difference. That's yep. one dead. Take that. I will. I, I have taken that. Good. I'm glad. 
That's all right. I get some nice attacks back. And I have a sergeant with a power sword. Who's going to go first? Mm -hmm. We'll get three attacks. Uh, one hit. Because this is just basic tactical marine. But yep. it does wound. And that uh, will go HP straight three. through your armor. It's AP3. We then have five attacks back. Mm -hmm. Hitting on fours. Hitting on fours. Wounding on, on fours. fours. One, one wound. One three up. Loves it. And that's the drawn combat. Drawn combat. Because obviously we add up the number of wounds we caused. Yep. And um, it's drawn. Okay, so we've got this combat first. The lightning claw is going to go first from the Cataphractite. Not the Cataphractite. Tartarus, sorry. Tartarus. And we're going to miss. Cool. All right. Okay, so we get turn. chain fest. Oh, I got my... Uh, your Praetor will actually go Praetor, first. Yeah. So but finally. he's too far. Now he will be okay. Yeah. So he'll go first. Five attacks. Hitting on three. Yeah, hitting on threes because your weapon skill is higher than mine. It's a Paragon Blade. So he's going to be winning you on threes. AP and it'll two. go straight through my armor. Yes. And murderous strikes are instant death on a yes. six up. They're looking for three sixes. Okay. Oh dear. So two invulnerables or that one. It's up so to you. I'm going to do this one first. The instant death. You and fail. That's one death. I die. And then two invulnerables. And I'm probably also going to die. Take a single yes. wound. No, I'm dead because that's AP two. Oh. And you have four up in one save. I don't. You should try that. You yeah, try well, I'm, I'm Tartarus Armour, so I'm faster than you, but it means I die quicker, I guess. Yeah. Literally. Sure yeah. That's a shame. And then you get to consolidate. Yeah, and I get three up to four, and yep. I will just... Da -da. It's, it's fine. I'm Charge just going to come and slap you in a second. Probably. Just, so. Cool. All right, that's the end of my turn, I think. Yep. There's no morale. You will start your turn. You score one point. One point. You can, have, you can have my big thing. Thanks, Mike. Yeah. But with the silver iron will, you won't be scoring anymore. A apparently not, because I, I guess I just die. Just die. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go into turn two for the Empress Children. So these guys have consolidated on this objective. The Dreadnought and the Palatines have come to have a play. I can't react, which is very annoying, but good, because I just wait until you start shooting. Day, uh, day that's to fine. Shoot. I'm going to come slap you up with Lucius. So day yeah. to shoot, mate. Over here, you've consolidated the Javelin just a bit further away, and you deep struck your Sons of Forest Jetpack Boys right on the corner. They only just made it because you nearly fell off the board. Yeah, I nearly fell off the board. I thought... I'll try and bring them in roughly here. Then I've got seven inch scattered directly back. Yeah, if they'd fallen off the board, I would have been able to place them anywhere within 18 inches of this point, which has been this corner. Yeah, it's amazing that, isn't it? Crazy, crazy. Yeah. So that's the movement phase. You ready to shoot? I I am, and I'm hoping I can do better than last turn. So. Let's see how it goes. So the javelin will start the shooting phase into the dreadnought, and I will return fire as a reaction. And that's absolutely fine, because hopefully you'll be dead. So multi melter first, which is in melter range. Wounds. And it wounds. One five up in one. That goes through. Yep. And then we have two las cannons going at it as well. Yep. Both hit. Two hits. Yeah. Yeah, that's painful. But it does have Sunder, so I'm just going to have to check what that does quickly. Rerolls against Which vehicles. It's vehicles, but does it do anything against Dreads? Don't think so. Ouch. We'll double check that. Please. Thunder is just vehicles, I'm afraid. Yeah, that's, that's great. It makes sense, but ouch. Yeah, I'm going to return fire now. Uh, please be gentle. Then the auto cannon. Let's grab it. Yeah, what a shame. I'll hit. Turn seven, so threes. Yep. So three wounds. Yeah. And these are three up. That's Bum three wounds. Save. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> just, just. George, thank you for introducing me to Harry's. I love this game. Why, why you do this? <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. Are you feeling okay, George? I, I You've got, am, a, got a wangly stick. I have. I've got a nice, like, floppy flamer template there. Floppy flamer template. So, so we're going, going for that. flamer there. I want to shoot back again because of my iron silvery will. Can it, can my very it shiny off? iron will. I will return fire. <laughs> Blood iron hands. <laughs> so flamer. So I'm going to be wounding on fours instead of threes because I'm reducing strength by one. Yep, the three so wounds. Three wounds. I'm all good. Great. But I also have a Kerry's Assault Cannon. Yeah. So these will be hitting on twos. Cool. Uh, looking for some five now. So threes to wound, That's which four. is fine, but no rends, unfortunately. No rend. Uh, I do take a wound, so I do lose one. Oh, no. What a shame. <laughs> but before he dies, he gets <clears> to shoot back. Great. Yeah. So, three links. So my only issue with this is that there are ways you can basically shoot like four times in a turn with a unit, and it's just... Yeah. But you are dedicating all your reactions there if you're shooting with the same Yes, every that time. is true. Uh, so, all hit. 
All right? Because you think react four times over there, but if they're not really getting shot, then and no, not shoot true. four times. It's only like when you're really in the grill. Mm. So sixes. Yep. Wait, can I? Yeah, I can hit you. Uh, I'm four. four to seven. Seven. Yes. So you I can, can only wound on a six. Yes. So your so your sixes. guys can hurt my dreadnoughts. My guys can't hurt your dreadnoughts. Is yes. the case. There's five sixes, George. Obviously, you got five <sighs> wounds remaining. By the way. I, as long as I don't roll five ones here, I should be okay. 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 Fine. Fine. That's, fine, fine. That's, fine. You know, we're making up for it cool. now. Cool. So I lose my dreadnought. Uh, my terminator there. Uh, tactical my dreadnought. Tactical dreadnought. Cool. Uh, All right. Let's see what's going to go into five bolt pistols directly into them cool. and Lucius's. Go for so it. So for what it's worth, all hit. All hit. Wounding on fives and Lucius's hits and does not wound. The two so wounds. That's just two wounds, please. Oh, good. Ah, uh, surprise, surprise. <laughs> and then just a few more bolters coming uh, up. Yeah, just... We shot some bolters here, but because they're only strength three, they did nothing. That's all right. Iron hands, man. So good. All right, I've got the graviton cannon now. Okay, what would you like to do? So, these graviton cannons, we're going to be going over this guy. Okay, you're going to so try and clip clipping both. the unit and clipping the tank. Yeah, wicked. The first one hits. Hits, so it gets all of them. And the second yep. one will go three, three inches inch, backwards. Three inches this way. I think you might miss. Beep. Looks like you missed the Spartan, but you clicked the Praetor. So that's going to be four hits on the unit so and one hit on the Praetor. Four on hits. the Spartan, sorry. Uh, so on the Spartan, one hit, which is a pen. Yeah, it sure is. And on the unit, uh, that's going to be two wounds. Two wounds. Uh, AP, not a lot. So uh, not enough. Okay, that's two dead. Kills two, though. And the penetrating hit result will be a one. One. Crew stunned. Right, so that it. means your snap shooting, I believe. Snap shooting, that's right. Yep, that's fine by me. Cool. All right, and then we've got five missile uh, launches. Just five missile launches left, and I wasn't really sure where these are going to go. <sighs> but I think I'm going to try and glance some wounds off the Spartan, really. Makes sense, cool. So, four, four hits. hits. Looking six for sixes. Glance. Nothing. Cool. Good job, guys. All right, wicked. Excellent. Charging time. Okay, right, that's it. So we're into the charge phase. Who's gonna charge? I'm gonna charge the Dreadnought in first here, just so you can't kill the Palatines as easily. Right, okay. I will use Gorgon's Wrath. Which does? So basically it's an advanced reaction, and I overwatch, but I shoot twice as many shots, but it gets hot. Are you sure you're old enough to use advanced reactions, Mike? I'm very old to use, I'm very, very old, actually. That's, that's big so words. Gonna, so all of these are going to shoot twice into that, basically. I've got to roll these one at a time, George. I've just remembered, because it gets hot. Oh no, what a shame. I, I hope they uh, go the same way as your uh, plasma pistol sergeant over there. Every day. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to shoot this. We're going to go one, two, three, four. Is that okay? Yeah, that's absolutely The fine. first one. Twin links. So he has to take an armor save, which is all good. This is very annoying. Oh god, but one missed. And then six is to wound. Only two wounds. Okay. And so two two ups ready. on the dreadnought. Two two ups on the dreadnought. Yay! Oh, this are two. Fuck. Yep. <laughs> Alright then, then the Volkite from the Praetor. All hit. Yep. And so strength five. Strength five, so five to wound. Five to one wound. And you pass. Oh. Shit. Doesn't need, you to roll that, a, doesn't need to roll a two or a three charge and you'll fail. I mean, somehow, I don't really think I'm going to be failing that charge there. Well, with these guys, with him, it minus no, two I mean, to charge. The dreadnought minus two to charge. Yeah, they're going to be fine. fine. They're going to be fine, but it but was more might... to soak. It was more to soak up the Overwatch. To be perfectly honest with you. I know. I, know. I mean, look at that smile there. Look at that smug little bugger. Okay, charge range. Okay, I'm done playing Flight Simulator with a camera, so. All right, you're all good. Uh, yeah, somehow <laughs> I think in. I've I've made it. You have made Maybe. it. Maybe. So I'm made. actually going to come around to here. Okay, cool. And these guys are also going to go in. They're in. Oh, look, what a surprise. Yeah, it would have been nice to overwatch them. Yeah, I, I kind of figured you'd say that. So but then no. I needed to Gorgon's Wrath to try and do something before now, it hits me. Do you have any more reactions left? No. Right, okay. Because I used two in the shooting phase. So I think these guys are going to charge over here. The but they're going to need an eight inch charge to be minus two. So are we ready? Mm -hmm. They made it with a 12. Fight me. <laughs> Here we go. They made it in with a minus two, so 10 inch charge. Yep. 
Are you feeling good? Yeah, I am, because I actually get to make use of my Legion trait now. Um, okay. I'm also issuing a challenge to Mikey, which he is going to... I'm going to accept. Yep. As my Praetor. <laughs> oh, no, Centurion, sorry. Oh, dear. Okay, that didn't quite go to plan, but, you know, <laughs> I, I get plus one initiative, so you it's do, fine. Yeah. So as part of my Legion trait, on the charge, I get plus one initiative. So all my normal Marines and my Sergeant will be attacking before Mikey. However, he does have that Centurion there, so we'll be attacking at the same time with the Centurion. But he's so, got an unwieldy weapon. What, the Machinator Array, which is also unwieldy. Okay, so he won't be so fighting at that profile. You'll be fighting yeah. last. Though. Yes, that's fine. But it means all my attacks will be directed at you. So, yeah, there's that's that. cool. All right, uh, so do you want to do him first then? Yeah, that's absolutely fine. So the Sergeant gets two attacks base, mm -hmm. three on the charge, and plus one for his spear. Yeah. So all hit. Cool. And these are... Are you hitting on four? Sorry, what's your weapon skill? Uh, I'm weapon skill four, so... I think five, they five will beat it, five. so that'll be three hits, sorry. Yeah, cool. Um, but I will be wounding you on threes, because I get plus one strength. And one wound. that is one wound. Cool, so I have a refractor field, but because of my Sabbath Familiar, I get a pop in one more. Yep. Is it AP2 or AP3? Um, AP3, unfortunately. Okay. It would have been it's a rend on a six up, but... And instant death as well on a oh. six up, but... That would have been good. Shame. Uh, but my marines still attack before you as well. Yeah, sure do. So you get to attack with your marines first. Yep. Your bottle boys attack my bottle boys and kill two. Yep. My bottle boys attack your bottle boys and kill one. Yep. We got power fist. Yee. One hit. Looking for a one. That's uh, a two. Damn, that's going to kill one guy. That does kill one. AP two. And then we've got the centurion. So I'm just going to double check whether I want to attack with a power axe or his mecha tendril thingy, my bobby duties. Whichever one's worse, flakings. please. <laughs> <laughs> the centurion is going to fight with his machinator array. Donald array. Got shred. Yeah. What's your weapon skill? My weapon skill is four. Cool. Hitting on threes. All hit. Oh dear. We did on threes. You roll in. Oh dear. That's three AP two. That's, that's the AP two. So my sergeant dies. Sure does. And we have. And two more die. So you lost that combat way. by I have two. Lost combat. Because like you lost four, I lost. I oh know you lost combat by three. Because I oh, lost two. It becomes two because I still have my banner. Cool. So your leadership is minus two. So leadership six. Six. Are you ready? You fail. Yes. Okay, so now we have, to, we have to roll off and add our initiative, and I'm going to try and cut you down. Right. You rolled a six, so I can't beat Fight you. Fight me. So you run away four inches. Oh, no, 2d6, so it's a fall back move. Yep, okay. So falling back, 11. 11 inches. Amazingly enough. Has to be straight backwards. Why would you do this to me? I know. Haha. -ha. It'd be nice if you could fall back onto your objectives, but that's only an inch I away. Mean... Anyways. We You're not are, exactly far away. We are on that objective still. But I don't think you, you can do. hold it if you fall in back. Uh, the, you know, swing some around swing the roundabouts. Some and then still we'll alive. We'll consolidate forwards because we may as well. Yep. But that's not the combat we're mainly concerned about, though. But you did lose. Uh, I did. I did lose it. It's fine. You did lose. It's fine. I can take that loss for now. And let's because go Because we've the got Praetor Will Smith versus Lucius. Okay, we're going with this combat next. So, are you going to issue a challenge? I'm going to issue a challenge to your Praetor. I will accept with my Praetor, because I don't yeah, have to good. accept with him. No, you but don't. he will. He you will accept. accept. For what it's worth. Okay, so what's your initiative? So my initiative is seven, which I cool. believe becomes eight in the challenge as well. Yes, so you are faster than me. First. <laughs> okay, um, so Lucius, with so his swords, which sword are you going to go for? So he has the layer blade, so, the which is like blade. Fulgrim's sword that he gave him as a present. Yeah. So it the is... No, that's the bendy sword. That's ah, there. of course, of course. That's there. That's Fulgrim's yeah. sword. So I'm weapon skill six, I believe. Uh, I'm weapon skill seven. Okay, six attacks into my weapon skill six. So hitting on threes. And Lucius has hatred as well against you. And it's a master crafted weapon anyway, so he gets to reroll. And it's preferred enemy, so Great. you reroll ones as well. Preferred enemy, not hatred. <laughs> um, but that is Five still hits. five hits. Strength? Uh, strength doesn't really matter here. It's fleshbane. Flesh so it wounds on twos. And re uh, ones because of preferred re enemy. Reroll ones. Good That's job, four buddy. wounds. Uh, and these are AP2, though. AP2, so my invulnerable. Uh, so 4 plus. That's, uh, that's annoying. It'd be nice. I wish I'd given him the Cyber Familiar as well to give him a 3 plus invulnerable. Yeah, but he, he dead. He is dead. That's he dead. Annoying. Okay, cool. So that's my Warlord gone, which means I can no longer double react, but I can now react to get in the space. That's good. So it's not all bad. Eh, it's not all bad. I mean, I'm hopefully going to kill these Terminators as well now because I am Initiative 5 as well on That's the very sad. So I get to attack I'm initiative you. one, mate. Because I'm unwieldy. Oh yeah, chain fist. So go for it. So you get so to attack, get... attack with the dreadnought next? Uh, I'm gonna go for the Palatine Blades, let them get a bit of glory. Okay. So we have Actually no, I will do the dreadnought. So the we dreadnought's get four attacks, fun. Because it's fun. It's four attacks, so he hit his weapon skill. Weapon high. skill is five. So hitting on threes. So he hits on threes. Cool. And he'll be wounding on twos because he's strength nine.
Just, just. Jump down, George. Sorry. Bye, Mikey. I'll see you later. Bye, mate. <laughs> Anyway, the Palatines are going to go next. Yeah, so like I said, Mikey, Palatines are going to attack next they because want they're, glory. they're really fun and they want the glory. Yes, they do. So they get two base. Uh, mm -hmm. The sergeant gets three base um, and on the charge we'll get four. Cool. So he has a Phoenix Spear, which will be hitting on threes. Cool, four hits. Uh, four hits, wounding on threes as well. And Ooh. those two are rending and murderous strike as well. So they're instant death. Yes. Cool, so I'll take my two in ones on the instant death, which I pass both, and the main one on the other one, which I pass. Thanks, Mikey. You're so welcome. Chunkers um, be chunking. Yeah, chonk. apparently they do. <laughs> it's uh, just so lit chonk, then the George. Palatine Blades will then yep. get to attack. So they'll be hitting on threes as well. For their weapon skill five. Because they are weapon skill five, which seems to be really good this edition. Sure does. Um, and then wounding on Strength. fours. But that one is rending and um, instant death. Cool. So that's yes. murder strike as well. Yeah. So one murder strike. Which I fail, so that's one dead. And then how many more saves? Five? Uh, five more, please. Five in ones? AP2, yeah? Uh, no, AP3. Oh, okay, cool. So, so. I'll pass. They're just wandered. Yep. They're That's just it. better power swords, really. They yeah. just get the instant death and rending. So. Cool. So you've killed two models. So I've got to kill two mods before I make you fail uh, around. Probably not difficult. Yeah, because I want to fight the Dreadnought, but I think if I kill all but the you... Palatine boys, I'll win combat. Lucius also has been upgraded to have Sonic Shriekers, so he's basically read at you, and it means that your hit rolls are at minus one. So... Okay. And I'm higher than you anyway, so you're so be hitting, hitting on sixes. sixes. Oof. Yes. Right, I'll go for the unit then. I'm pleased to know the Sonic Shriekers only work on the charge, and if you are fearless, you don't care, because yeah. apparently loud noises don't work if you're not scared. That's true. That's true. Hitting on sixes then. That's one hit. Yep. I'm going to lose combat. Then I don't kill anyone. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's one wound you had to do there, Mikey. I can see that. that. I can see that. That's fine. How does it feel, Mikey? That's fine. I wish I'd, why did I hit the Dreadnought? Should I hit the Dreadnought? It re-rolls the wound. It would have done a wound. Damn it. Okay. Cool. So that's that combat done. Yep. And the uh, ward gone. We've just got this one to just resolve, one. which we'll do now. I managed to cause a wound and you did nothing, so I win by one. Yep. They so should check leadership. on... Step. Yeah, which will pass. You just pass because you got Only your leader there. All good. Over here, I've got leadership check. I've lost by two, one, two. So I'm leadership fixed. Three, four, five. So I fail. Yep. So I've got to fall back. Would you like to try and cut me down? I am going to try and cut you down. Who with? Lucius, of course. What's your, the what's your initiative, naturally? So in initiative, naturally, is six. I need to match you, but you get plus two to the dice. Yes. So are you going to set me boundary? They did. Well, they just get cut down. Yes. Brilliant. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> My hammer unit has now fallen. That's very sad. Oh, no. I've fallen. I know, literally. Okay, that's your turn. Yep, that's fine. Do you get an extra D3 points to kill my Warlord? Are you ready? You get an extra one. You want two. I saw that as a six for a second there. <laughs> <laughs> so you want two, two points so far. Point. Well done. That's the end of turn two. Yeah, come on, come on. Yeah, it's turn two. I George. need more turns, Mikey, please. Sorry, turn two. <laughs> Let's go into turn three. So this unit have consolidated forward so we can rapid fire into here and you fear over the Legion. The Dreadnought has turned around and he's pulling back because we just wanted to kill these because they're really fast and they're a scoring unit as well. Oh lord, he coming. He be coming. The Spartan has spun round. We've had a look at the firing arc. This is this the entire half of the model. So I can shoot it over here. Yeah, it's split fire. Exactly. These guys have uh, just consolidated, pretty much just stayed on stayed still so they can shoot as well. And these Terminators have moved forwards and they've um, gone after these and you've withdrawn. You've moved further away. Yes, I've done another nice tactical retreat because mm -hmm. fuck your lightning claws. So. I can see that. Yeah. <laughs> so they've gone over there just to make my charge a little bit harder. Yeah. So that's it. Let's go into the shooting phase. George is filming because I'm going to use Fury of the Legion over here into those guys in the corner because I want them dead. So I get this many bolter shots. You ready? Um, yeah, I guess. Threes. Just ones and twos. We don't, we don't want any more I'll than that. I'll just take fours. So it's this many saves. Great. Okay, so it's 11, 11 saves and um, George is going to be using evade. I'm going to evade, which means I get a five up, feel no pain. Yeah, so three up, five up before you die. Yep. So three up, three ups. Fail four. Fail four. So five up. It okay. helps. So That's two just two dead. That's not too bad. Um, That's all right. Take from the front here. Makes sense. Try and reduce the charge for your dreadnought. Yeah, cool. And I got a positive pistol. Hit. Well, it kind of four. gets hot again. It does go through AP2. Uh, yeah, so five up. You made your five up. Well done. About time. Got the Dreadnought with the auto cannons. All hit. Three to wound, but sixes are rending. That's what I like to see, Mikey. A bit more of that, Bolter. please. Fours. 
Two wounds of the bolter. Okay, two wounds of the... Yeah, yes, a lot more of that, please. That's, Stop that's it. much better. Stop it. After after the rolls for the Terminators and the Javelin. Yeah, uh, fair, that's sort of that's fair enough. That's fair enough. Okay, so this unit now we're going to shoot into the Palatines. I'm going to shoot the bolters first. Here we go. Freeze the hit. And fold the wound. That is five wounds. And five, five two saves. Damn it. Yep, that's fine. Plasma pistol. Doesn't hit. And then we've got the Volkite Charger. Yep. Ho, ho, ho. Two hits. Uh, so five, so three. So three to wound. That's one wound. Don't fail it. And please don't fail. Okay. So now, what does that do, Mikey? So because I've caused a wound, I get another hit at the stain profile. So uh, on threes. Doesn't wound. Uh, that's okay. okay. Got the Spartan. We've really got to deal with that Dreadnought. We need to pick some wounds off him. We're going to put the Heavy Bolter into the Palatines. We're going to put the last Cannon and the Multi Melter into this Dreadnought. And we're going to put the other last Cannon into this Dreadnought to try and cause a morale. Into into this Dreadnought, Mikey. You just said into, into this, this dread Dreadnought. I heard into this Dreadnought. This not tactical Dreadnought armor. So, <laughs> so we'll go okay. from here, last Cannon into this unit. Hitting on yep. threes. The Gunner's Wounded getting dizzy. Twos. That is one dead. That's great. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> and that causes a leadership. It sure does. We'll do that in a minute. Uh, we've got the last cannon here into the Dreadnought, so hitting on threes. Both hit. Wounding on threes. One wound. On the Palatine, yes? So no, on the Dreadnought. No, 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 on the Palatine, yeah. No, on the no, Dreadnought. totally on the Palatine. Five of Inborn. Yep, it's fine. Multi Melter. Hit. Wounds. I'm going to make a five up in. in Takes a wound. Oh, well. You and then we've got the Heavy stuff. Bolter. Rerolling hit. And this is into the Palatine, so threes. So three wounds. Two ups. Love it. Okay, cool. Um, I think that's shooting, so we just got morale for your, your boys in the corner. They have passed. Wicked. All right, let's go into the charge phase. Okay, so we've got the Dreadnought. He's going to be charging into this unit. Would you like to react? I'm going to hodl. You're going to hodl? I'm hodl the hodl. line? Hold paper, paper hands line. or diamond hands? Uh, Hopefully diamond hands. Okay. okay. We're going to see if we can make the charge, but it'll be, deny it'll be making me have a disordered charge. I do not make the charge. Uh, I thought it was safe. These terminators are going to charge here, so I think I need a six or a seven. I'm going to double check. Is it yeah, six? Yeah, we'll have a look. Let's have a look. Is six uh, in? That's a seven. That's a seven, Mikey. Yep. I'm trying to be faster, but no, I'm just, well, gonna, just keep just keep getting. I think that reaction earlier was definitely worth it. Was moving back. Big time. So, big big time. time. Cool. Okay, so we just got one combat, and it's over here. Yeah. So we'll just resolve that and see what but happens. I've just realised my advanced reaction is only once a game, so ignore me. <laughs> nice try. <laughs> okay, so we just resolved combat over here. I actually lost by two. Here we go. I passed because I rolled perfect. I need to roll. Oh, leadership seven. Leadership seven. I've just failed. You lost your sergeant. Bugger. Yeah. Okay, so I fail combat. So you can advance. Are you going to do you it? ready? You rolled a three. I need to roll three. Oh, he gets away. Thank God. So we're just going to fall back onto the objective. <laughs> Huzzah! Huzzah. I mean, that's why you don't give your sergeants plasma pistols so they don't blow up. But... No, I only give them plasma pistols because that's what comes in the kit, George. It doesn't actually come with the bolt. They don't come with the bolt pistol. Only the holstered ones, I believe. Why, EGW? Don't know. It's what? Funny. When are we going to get the bolt pistol kit in the special weapons? <laughs> <laughs> Literally. All right, that's the end of my turn, George. Yeah. So you've got. Are you doing... I'm just doing my. You know, consolidate. You know, consolidate, thank you. Okay. That's the end of my, uh, out, yeah. end of my turn. I'm still winning. Uh, for now. For you're going to score... Nothing. No point. Because you can only score with line units. Now, for some reason, Palatine Blades aren't line. No, but so. only my troops are, so the more you yes. kill my infantry, the better. So I need to get rid of your infantry. You sure do. So let's go into George's turn three. Three. So these guys have consolidated over here trying to take this objective, but because I, my Warlord is dead, I can react in the movement phase. So I withdrew and just put everybody on the objective. you got to kill all of them now. Great. <laughs> Over here, these guys have, have pushed forwards, thinking about a Spartan, maybe these, we don't know yet. Uh, I mean, I've got Power Fist, so I could possibly glance at Spartan a little bit. Yeah. But it'd be more likely the Dreadnought or this Tactical Squad, and I'm feeling the Tactical Squad is the tactical choice. Yeah, enough. for sure. These guys have consolidated forwards, trying to deal with these, and then these guys have grouped onto the objective as well. Yeah. That's a movement phase, you got a shooting phase? Uh, I do, amazingly enough, what and I've got a Flamer template, which is going to be Flamer on these four guys. Okay. So, four hits. Yep. Wounding on threes. What strength are uh, they? Four, sorry. One wound. Strength, strength five with a heavy flamer. Yeah. So it's down to strength four. So, one wound. Loves it. Yep, and it's fine. Uh, and then the assault cannon as well, which will be six shots. Mm -hmm. Hitting on twos. So, four hit. 
There's Looking threes. for threes to wound and sixes are rending. But no, no rending, but six saves. All please. wounds. So two ops. Uh, take a single wound. Yep. Um, these guys are going to then fire their bolters. Okay. So four bolters at you. Fives to wound because yay, iron hands. One wound. Loves it. I saw a one for a second there, so that's annoying. <laughs> um, we've got bolt pistols over here. Okay. So four bolt pistols at the tap marines. Yep. Uh, all hit because they're hitting on twos. Um, one wound though. One single wound. And Lucius. Bales. Let's take this one to make your charge a bit longer. Yeah, fair enough. Over here, we have five bolt pistols. Yep. So. I will shoot back with um, return fire. Yeah, that's that's fine. You, after you've taken your one armor wound. safe, sir. Loves it. Yep, that's fine. Ten shots straight back. Three to hit with return. Four's to him, not fives, because I'm better than you. <laughs> Three, can, six, can seven wounds. Three, four, five, six, seven. Damn it. God yeah, damn it. Fine. You're going to have to fight me. are so bad. <laughs> <laughs> you got your pile of doom in the corner. I've got pile of doom in the corner. And, and you've also got, got some bolt pistols here. But I'll do the pile of doom in the corner first. Okay. Graviton gun. So the grav cannons, obviously the pie plate. Cool. So the first one, Hits. direct hit. And second the second one. one will be three Nine. inches that way. So about yeah. there, which will hit. Yep. Cool. So, so two hits. Looking for two sixes, so just one, one glance. glance, unfortunately, this time. It goes down to four. Now, I feel like I should actually get the missile launcher to do something. Mm. You're going to try and kill some Terminators, or are you going to try and kill some Spartan? Well, the thing is, I can see the Dreadnought in the corner. You can see the Dreadnought? Hmm. You could go for the Dreadnought. You're in range. I think I you mean, probably it's are. 48 inch range, and they are. They are in range. They are in range. You're so we're going to go for missile launchers at the Dread. Okay. So, three hit. Yep. And then three through. <laughs> George, you're doing this so much. This is beyond a joke now. Am I a joke to you, Mikey? Yes. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> so these guys shot up here and actually managed to kill one. And we got some charges. And these guys are going to charge into here. Go for it. With a five. I think that you're probably enough right. to get up to here. They've managed to make it in by standing on windows and things. Uh, these guys have declared a charge, but I did manage to kill one in Overwatch. So we'll take to charge at minus right. two. I'm just going to return the favor. Well done. And come round here. Cool. That's them. Uh, over here, would you like to charge? I am going to charge. And obviously, Lucius and his squad over here. You are with in a minus with a two. Four inch charge. It's absolutely fine. Sweet. And the Dread is also going to be going, but he's going to be going at the Terminators, which okay. will still be minus two because I'm on the terrain, annoyingly. That's a one inch charge. Oh, that's charge. a one inch charge. And that's. The crown point tip. Yeah. Oh, wait. <laughs> and just, yeah, I think I'm a bit more than an inch away there, Mikey. I think so. That's great. I love that. Would you like to surge half an inch? Well done. <laughs> okay, so we just resolved combat over here. I lost by one because I lost the whole dude. So, leadership six. I pass. Just. So, just. That, could, that objective is now contested. Mm -hmm. So, no points for me there. Um, okay, where would you like to go next? Uh, I think we'll I'm going to go over here. The cool. So, they've technically piled in essentially yep. where they are. So, they get to fight. I'm going to issue... I may as well accept, so... I'm not going to issue a challenge, actually. There's no point, really. Why? Because I'd rather just kill all your marines instead. Okay, so we've got three chainsaw going in first, nine attacks on the charge. Yep. So we are hitting on fours. Yep. And wounding on fours, but chainsaws now get shred. So that so means we, we get to reroll all wounds. So two so far. Um, four. four. AP. Four. No AP, just... Well, you kill one. Kill one there. So the centurion gets five attacks on the charge with pistols yep. close combat weapon. Uh, and he is hitting on threes. He does hit. And wounding on threes as well. Killing on threes, in fact. Okay. AP3. AP3, so five dead. Five. I just have the power fist left, but you guys okay, get, so to I get to attack first. I get to strike first. So we'll pile in onto the objective to try and kill some. And in fact, they're not Emperor's children, so technically they attack at the same time as the Chainsword guys. Oh, okay. Of course, because you do get the bonus, do you? No, so. but you are minus one strength. Minus one strength. Because of the Sons of Horus rule. That's their special yes. rule. So I get three of them attacking. Yeah, three of them attacking. Hitting on fours. Wounded on fours. Nothing. And then I've got the uh, the Lightning Claw. Yep. Two hits. Into the unit, obviously. Rerolling because yep. of Shred. Luckily. Uh, so one rending and one normal. Um, and so AP3. Normal is AP3. So it's just two dead. I'm going to obviously kill one, which is the rending. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to take a two of armor save from the Sergeant. Ooh. Which is fine. Cool. So, so only one, one of them dies. Sweet. So I've lost morale by a lot. Uh, so I've lost by... By five. By five. But I actually have the banner. So, so it four. four. So at least it four. 
which I pass because I'm insanely brave. Uh, that's fine because I outnumber you there. So. You do outnumber me there, which is kind of annoying. But there we go. You know, not all um, bad, not all bad. Just on to all right. Lucius's pimp squad. Right, then will you accept one. my challenge, good sir? Uh, I will accept with. The Praetor's gonna have yeah. to accept. Well, the Sergeant can oh, take the Centurion. Accept. Yeah, the Centurion so. will accept. Let's get his attacks ready. Okay, so Lucius gets six attacks. Just shuffle them in. Yeah, cool. Yep. So six attacks with Lucius. Ready? Yep. All hit. All hit. Oh, uh, Master Crafted. Oh, yeah. Because of course. I hit you on threes. Um, wounding on twos because of uh, Fleshbane. Yep. With the character hatred thing. That so is... that is six saves. Six saves. All six, in four, one. four up in ones because of the Cyber Familiar. Okay. Uh, he, he dead. He's dead. Damn. He then did. you get the power time blaze because they only stood five. So I get four attacks on the sergeant. He missed. And one hit. Oh, okay, his weapon cool. skill five. That's one dead. Uh, and one is dead because it's just rending. Yep. Um, we then have three, six, nine because you've managed to kill a palatine. Wounding on fours. And these um, are AP3. These are AP3. Okay. They're actually AP2 because of rending, but it oh. doesn't matter. So he's, they're all dead. Yep. Right, my um, sergeant with his power fist into the Palatine. Two hit. No. Because I'm weapon skill five. Oh, and on the charge as well, I reduce you to hit by one. Because of did, Sonic yeah. Shriekers. Yes, I'd be on six. Um, yep. Okay, cool. So I lose combat there by four. So four. I fail. What's your natural initiative? So I'm going to take the initiative of Lucius, which was six. Okay, so you get plus two on me. Five. So I need to roll seven. Oh, I do not oh, roll look, seven. Mikey does not roll a seven. <laughs> so that's me dead there. And then these guys are just going to shuffle up. Yowzer. Okay, cool. What a turn. Great turn. Really fired up there. Yeah, that's much better, but I'm starting to run out of scoring units here, really. And that was a bit of a shame over well, here. Well, so am I. <laughs> yeah, that's true, because... Well, it's just them and them, really, isn't it? Yeah, so. exactly. Yeah. Right, okay, cool. So that's the end of your turn. You don't score yep. any points yet. Um... But it's on my turn, you've, con you've contested that one contested. and you've stopped and scoring stopped that one, there. so that's called zero. So, but I'm still winning, 5-2. Yeah, but it's also a point of, can you kill Lucius and get the Warlord points? And can you actually come back and get rid of my scoring yes. units? I've got to kill more units than you in this game as well, yes. which I don't know if I've done. But I we'll do save. have a lot of small units though. Yeah, we'll see. So let's go into Iron Hands turn 4. Okay, in the movement phase, George hasn't reacted because he's not really been able to. Didn't want to. No, didn't want to. So the Dreadnought's going over here because he wants to support over there. The Spartan has shuffled a little bit, but it's just so he can basically shoot that and then shoot over there. And the Terminators have stayed still because if I move towards him, he can always react. So I've got a three inch charge. He could make it four. I didn't even bother moving. No. Smart, right? Yeah. Smart. I mean, big brain play there. Big brain plays coming in. So let's go straight into the shooting phase. We're going to go with the Spartan. He's going to put everything into. Oh, actually, do I? Oh, I had an idea. A lance cannon into the missile launchers just to get rid of a couple of those. Okay. Is that okay? <laughs> no, no, it's not. Right. That's illegal. That's illegal. <laughs> I'll put the heavy bolters there and then everything else into them. Yep. Cool. So lance cannon first into the missile launchers. Three linked. One hit. The twos. That's one dead. Would you like to react? That entire unit could shoot back. Yeah, go on. Cool. Okay, so one dead. But what I will do before you start shooting off, remember it will not die on a six plus. Nope. Okay, so you get five shots back. There's a reaction. Four uh, hits. Four hit. Sixes to wound. Look at the sixes to glance. Two, that's two glances. Nice, that's down to two. About time they did something. <laughs> okay, we've got the heavy bolter into the palatine. We roll in. All hit. Uh, threes. That's four saves, please. Four two ups. Yep. Bagger. Fine. <laughs> uh, we've got the Laz cannon into the dreadnought. We roll in. Both hit. Hey! Melter. Hits. Wounds. Oh. Hey! God damn it. <laughs> Dreadnoughts are so good. I love Dreadnoughts. They're Dreadnoughts probably are my so, favourite so unit in the game. Especially yes. Contemptors. Well, I'm an Iron Hands player and they love Dreadnoughts, so I guess I play loads of Dreadnoughts now. With Plastic Leviathan. I love Iron contemptors. Hands, me. I do, yeah. So that's the Spartan done. We can't shoot here because we're going to combat. Got a charge here? I think he's in. Boop. And we've got a charge over here. What are they going at, though? Uh, just to, just into this unit. Would you no, like no, to react? I think you should charge a Dreadnought. No? Um, I may as well. I'm going to watch you. Yeah, watch or hold the line. Uh, you've got one there on one wound. You're going to butcher me no matter what, because yeah. you get a lot of attacks. 
So I'm just gonna overwatch you. Okay. Winning on fives, that's two wounds. Loves it. They're gonna charge. Guess, guess I'll die then. Guess you'll die. They'll charge to there. Okay, we're gonna resolve this combat first. Are you doing anything fancy? Because I'm just hitting um, your unit funnily enough. Yeah, so we're all attacking at the same initiative. So I'm probably just gonna try and kill your tacticals before your dreadnought pummels me. Makes so. sense. So I'll do my dreadnought first. Hitting on threes. So it does two hits. Wounded on twos. Please roll double ones like I did. No. Oh, damn so it. this is brutal three. So brutal three causes three wounds for every wound. So you take six yeah. wounds AP two. And these are AP two, and my sergeant has artificer armor, but it won't matter because it goes straight through. Yeah. So they'll be dead, but they still get to attack first. Sure. So the sergeant will get three attacks. Mm -hmm. Two hits. These are going into the tacticals. Of course. One dead tactical. Yep. And then three attacks from the normal dudes. Nothing. Nothing. I okay, killed cool. one, but the squad. He's gone. This card's dead. And then he's going to consolidate. Like so. The dreadnoughts are a tactical's best friend. Sure are. Okay, cool. So that's that combat. Over here, your initiative four. Yeah, but so are you. Do you want to issue a challenge? Um, I guess. I'll issue a challenge first. Yeah, fight me then. Literally does nothing. <laughs> so the Empress Children have four, and they didn't manage to do anything because they've obviously got no AP over there. Now I get a bunch of attacks. I get plus one for charging, and I also get plus one for two specialist weapons. And I'm going to start the removement phase. You sure are. Here we go. So hitting on fours. So you fine. So fours we roll in. So that is four at AP2 because Oops. I've rendered. Oh dear. And you that have four left. the whole squad. <laughs> Which is a shame because I was hoping to take some on the two up armor save on the sergeant. But... Yeah, I thought so. Then we'll consolidate. Yep. My initiative value so that's going to be further away from you up here. So I'm bullying, being a bit of a bully over here. Uh, that's fine. I've got Dreadnought there. Oh yeah. Okay, I think that's my turn done. Oh, you've it's got this one. Hit. Oh, bugger. Okay. So, who's going to go first? So, the sergeant's going to go... Uh, the character is going to go first, okay. which will be four attacks. Two hits. Yep. Look of threes. Two dead. Two dead, because AP2. Uh, AP3. But AP3. Sorry. Same difference. And then we get the rest at the um, same initiative. You've got a lightning claw there, so if you I want to do that attacks... You have a lightning claw. Uh, one hit. Fails. Rerolls. That's one wound. AP3. Okay, it's fine. Just on the sergeant. Okay, cool. Yep. <laughs> um, and then we get to pile in. So you get a bit, gonna... a bit more piling. So actually, we'll, uh... shuffle these guys up to here. Yep. And you can see the window. More, so I think he's probably dead now. Yeah. Uh, I'll just do, do, the do, do the power fist. Amazingly fist, enough. Yeah. <laughs> so his attack. Uh, sorry, it'll be two one. attacks. <laughs> what? No uh, which will miss. Cool. And then we'll get one, <laughs> two, three, four. George, he's, not, he's, he's just dead. Just let me just. Tell I just you take you him can off. take him off if you want. I'm going to make you roll it, but we'll make you roll it okay, off camera. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> okay, the end of Iron Hands turn four. George has managed to kill all of those. Uh, I've consolidated and secured that objective, so I'll be, I am holding it ready for next turn. The start of George's turn, he's holding one objective, so it'll be 5 3. Yep, that's fine. I at least get another point, I guess. You do get another point. So let's go into Emperor's Children turn four. So movement phase, this unit is secured on this objective, they're just trying to hide down around the corner, just so. Uh, they can't get seen as easily. Uh, the character's detached and he's jumped to go after the Dreadnought or the unit. Probably the unit, but we'll Probably see. the unit stop you scoring as much. Yep, this is true. It depends if the Dreadnought lives or not. Yeah, for but, sure. And then these guys have moved forwards, but I've reacted and moved four inches further away from it. They're charged really long. Hmm. So you like is... making charges really, really long. Because I'm just going to be killing units now. Good at that, but... Yeah, I'm just going to be killing units. I've talked bricks of ten, you've got like, lots of little units of five and stuff. Yeah. Which so that's what I'm trying to do. Bit of a shame. Yeah. Hopefully I can pipe like Spartan. You can try. Would you like so, to do that now? I'm going to do that now. I'll do that okay. first. We've got stuff ready. First one. So first one will be four inches that way. Four inches, yeah. So I think you'll probably still clip it. Or maybe. Yeah. yeah. Gun. One clip. And the second one. Uh, four inches backwards. Like again. Four inches that way. Nice so double check as well. It'll probably just clip. Come no. on, miss. No. no. Okay. So two hits. The so two, two can ops. And I glance it. I want okay. pen as well. So it does die. Does it explode? No. No. It so it crumbles. It crumbles and falls. The Spartan is down. At last. That's it. All right. Um, cool. And I'm shooting. I'm going to do four missile launchers at the Dreadnought, funnily enough. Ooh. Can they actually do something this time? So they all hit. hit. And three we get wounds. three wounds. Uh, AP? AP three. So AP you still three. get your two, so two up on us. Oh, good. That's annoying. Okay. So we threw a bolt pistol into the unit and did nothing. So over here we've got a dreadnought. A dreadnought in flamer range still. Sure. Getting two. Winning on fours. Two wounds. No AP. 
Your tops. Go past. That's all right. We've got the assault cannon next, Shut which is hitting on twos. And then wounding on... Wounding on threes, but threes, that's a rend. Twos. So one rend. And four normal. Yeet. Makes it. Yep. And four normal. Oops. Makes them. Makes them. Absolute chads. We then have some bolt pistols coming at you. Sure. So Lucius. Hits. Five to wound. Nope. Nope. And then four normal bolt pistols. Two wounds. Two wounds for the strength three. Hey, we one got wound. one. Kills one. All right, cool. Into the charge phase, I think. So we've got two charges of Dreadnought <coughs> first. I am going to hold the line against the Dreadnought. Hold you failed. You need failed seven. That. And needing uh, a not that. A double one. That's Would a that surge? Uh, yes, I will. So, so it's he half. Gets to, they get to move zero. Because they're minus two. Yes, that's true. And he gets to move. He uh, gets like to move. Three inches. That's three there. Cool. All right. I'm tempted to charge with a missile launcher because I might just die next turn anyway. Yeah, but... They do have to do a morale check because they lost 25% of the squad. That's true. They're all good. Okay. You going to charge over there? Oh, no, I'm going to do over here, I think. Okay. Just into your tacticals. Thing. Makes sense. There's the oh, nine-inch charge. There's the nine-inch charge. <laughs> and hello. Hello there. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Excellent. Right, okay. Do you want to just attack over here? It's the early combat. Yep. Initiative five. Five attacks. Sure. Being on threes. Great. Well, they're not dead. Uh, they might run away because they are that is two dead. Okay. Light attacks back. Hits. Wounds. Two up. Okay, that's fine. Cool. The leadership. Minus two, so six up. Well, less than six, sorry. <coughs> oh, Lord. He running. What's your initiative? Five. Five. So I've got to roll a six to not die. To, to not score die. a point. But if I did, would that be annoying? That would. That would be. That would be a mighty one, diamond six. hands hoddle. Bye. Bye, Mikey. <laughs> just, 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 bye. Just bye. So sadly, that doesn't actually change anything. It just means I've got one Marine left because he runs back four inches, but then you can consolidate towards me again. Yeah, but I mean, it'd be better if you were dead. But... I mean, this is true. This is very true. Okay, so that's the end of your turn. Yep. Um, so it's basically, you can hold, you, you're going to score one more point in turn five unless I can kill yes. them. That's pretty much all I can do. So I've got to try and kill more units. Yep. So let's go into Iron Hands. Uh, right. We've regrouped with the Tactical Marine and the Dreadnought is consolidated to try and get rid of this guy because he's awfully annoying. And over here we've moved the Terminators and George reacted with the Missile Boys. Yeah, they're probably still going to get butchered, but... We'll see. What we'll see. That's the plan. If I can get rid of those and kill this guy over here, that's going to tie us on killed units. You won't get an extra point. Yeah, so I might true. just win. Might just win. Might just win. We'll see. We're going to shoot everything from this Dreadnought into your Centurion. Yep. For the auto cannon. I'll hit. Strength seven. So that is one rending. Which I will ignore on a five up. Cool. And then two two up armors. It's fine. Sweet. And then the bolter. We roll in. And one wound. Fine. Cool. Okay. All right, you just punch me to death. Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> so that's the shooting phase. Obviously, the Spartan's dead. So we're going to try and charge into the missiles. Would you like to react? Um, I may as well overwatch. You may as well. Here's a charge. I do charge. So you will get in. All hit. All hit. And that to wound would be nice as well. Uh, and we will all wound. Three wounds. Um, four wound wounds, twos? in fact, because I wound on twos. Okay, so four, four pin ones. Nope. Oh, no. You're fine. Wait. AP three. Wait, what? So, so I just lose one? You just lose one. Oh, I thought they were AP two. Nope. Oh. Missile launchers oh, only AP God. three. <laughs> thank God. Yeah. <laughs> made it. Yeah, charge eight inches and we go right over here. I was oh, running away God. from Lucius and his squad. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> okay, and then we're going to charge over here. Yay. Oh, look, he's made it. Boop. All right. So we'll start over here. We're in the same initiative. So would you like to fight me first? And then I'll like, fight straight back. I may as well. It'll be five attacks. Um, that'll be three hits. Mm -hmm. One wound. One wound, one two up. Loves it. So my attacks. The sergeant gets two. Also, would you like to accept the challenge? Can you like? Can no, you? no, I didn't. It's okay. fine. Um, so I get this many attacks, I get four and three. Yep. I can't hit anything. But I wound one. And the sergeant has a two up armor save, so I'm going to take it on that. Fine. Okay. Cool. Actually, no, he didn't, because I didn't pay for that. So he's dead. Ignore that. His point. Cool. So we've got a drawn combat over there. And you're in combat, so at least you can't shoot. Yep. 
Uh, do I not lose that combat? Actually, I have a Vexilla, so it counts as plus one. So yeah, so I would win if you didn't have the Vexilla. If I didn't have the Vexilla. So. Cool. All right, over here, you're into five. I will attack you first, of course. So You'll try. I'm going to go for the weird Chthonian axe thing. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll be hitting you on fours because of the same weapon skill. Sure. Uh, won't do anything, I don't think. Um, okay. Not strength eight. Not strength <laughs> Put it that eight. way. Okay, so I get four attacks back. Yep. Weapon skill five. Uh, yes. Hit so hit on fours. fours. Oh, what I like to see. Twos to wounds. Twos to wounds. No. So because I rolled a two, what I rolled to wounds, that's brutal. three wounds because of brutal. And I take one. What's your strength? What's your toughness? It's instant death, in it? But do you have a turn of warrior? Get doinked. Doink. Bruh. Doink. <laughs> there you go, he's dead. Oh, I was doing so well. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's the end of my turn, I think. Yep, that everything. is. So you, we've drawn combat, we've killed over there. So it's your final turn. My final turn. So Can I do Empress anything? Children, turn five. Okay, so the Sons of Horus have jumped packed over here. They've scored their points. So it's five four, but they've moved towards him to so his reactor. So he's just within three, but it's a longer charge. That I might charge the dreadnought because I've got shred. So you could charge the dreadnought. That'd be fun. And I got power fist. Yeah, we could do it. Um, over here, you move the Dreadnought, the Rapiers, and Lucius all towards the well, The Rapiers don't have anything else to shoot at, so I may as well slap you with them. This is true. This is very true. Um, okay. So, that's it for the movement. Let's go into shooting. In the shooting phase, you're going to try and shoot the Dreadnought. You strength three because I'm an Iron Hand. Yeah, and so I that's can't it. actually wound you. So, nope. that's great. Cool. So, charges. Are you going to charge? Who I'm, charge? These are going to charge the Dreadnought. Okay. You may as well. You are in there with a four. That's cool. Sweet. I realise this is the only unit that can react, so I did overwatch there and nothing happened. Over here, we've got more charges. Now, do I do Lucius first or do I do the Dread? I feel like I'll do the Dread first, it's my sense of choice. Okay, so what do you need? I need a 7 for the Dread. Okay, 7 is charge. You have failed. I think it was 7. Oh, I think it was 7. No, it's actually 6. Oh, that's convenient, isn't it? Oh, well, look at that, convenient. Mikey. Look at that. Convenient. I haven't moved anything. Go for it. Yeah. Now, Lucius can't charge because it's too far, probably. I mean, well, so he needs a 10. We needed a 10 there. And that's gonna is be that with painful. minus 2? It is with minus 2. That's a 6 and a 1. That's, that's cocked, Mikey. That's, that's a double that's, one. That's a double 1. Do you want to surge that's, that's nowhere because you rolled difficult terrain? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so these guys are now going to try and charge and come all the way around, which okay. is going to be a, a yes. Yeah. That's going to be a 7. That's not a 7. Just uh, a dreadnought, mate. He's just a dreadnought. Just the dreadnought. Yeah, it's all right. He's making up for that like two-inch charge that he did over here. Yeah, so. for sure. Do the dreadnought first. He's initiative five because he charges ten. Yep. So hit on threes because he's higher weapon skill. Okay. Just twos to win, George. Twos to win. Okay. That is three That's wounds for nine. each one. <laughs> that is nine wounds all the way through. And an invun as well. Yep. This is AP two because of that's because of brutal. So AP two, so four plus invuns. How would you describe that, Mikey? I'd say that is Dead. pretty brutal. That yeah. is quite brutal. Contemptors are really good. Mm. That brutal really, really rule is very good. Very, very good. Thank you. Okay, cool. So that's him done. Would you want to consolidate? Um, I don't really need to, but hello. Hello? Is it me dark, you're my old friend. Right. All right, over here. Are you initiative higher than four? Uh, I am not. Okay, so we strike at So the we will same strike time. at the same time. Mm -hmm. Now, can I kill you with chainsaws? Shall I go first? You can go first, and you are minus one strength, which is still double, which is annoying. <laughs> yeah. So I've got the um, the fist hit on threes. That's what I likes to see. Okay, that's three dead. Is it AP two and it's brutal three? Yep. So we're gonna have three of them dead. Cool. But they get three attacks each first. You sure do. Hitting on fours or fives? So hitting on fives because you are a higher I'm better, weapon better skill. Better, better at fighting because I'm in a big box. You're better at fighting. I'm bigger, bigger box. Big box fight better. Big box fight better. Cool. Chainsword go brrr. What strength are you? Uh, four. So I'm strength four. The sixes. So it'll be sixes to wound, but they have shred. So re-roll. So that gets to re-roll them. That's no, two. two wounds. Two, two, two up. armors. Okay, one wound goes three. He's down to three. So we get three attacks from the sergeant who has a power fist. So it we get twice. two hits, two wounds. Two wounds. Is it, is it two uh, to strength wound? eight? So, so, so yeah, to it's three to wound. Yeah, so one wound, uh, uh, which 82. is AP two. So six, so six pin 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 Which I fail, so I take another wound. Yep. Okay. And Oops. three of my guys die. Three of your guys die. You lose combat by three. So yep. you are leadership five. 
Okay, I Killer lose combat by what, uh, by two because I paid for a Vexilla, so... Cool. I'm, I'm already running. You've definitely failed. So I'm initiative um, five, you're initiative four. Are you ready to get cut down? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. I need to roll a four. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, cool. And I think I roll 3d6 for how far I fall back. You do, yeah, because you've got to jump back. So you move 13 inches straight backwards. Yeah, Yeet. run away, run away. Go on, get gone. Oh, Lord, he running. Get off my lawn. <laughs> oh, Lord, he running. Okay, cool. So that is the end of that turn. So let's go into... Let's just see if the game continues. Yeah, pretty much. Cool. So at the end of that, it's 5-4 at the end of turn 5. If the game ends now, George has killed more units than me and will score an extra point, so it'll be a draw. Yep. Unless you would like to roll a 4 up and then we go into turn 6. It's optional. No money. No money. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to roll the big pink dice as well. You're going to roll the big pink dice. Are you 4 plus. It does end. It's, it's a, a draw. draw. Well done, George. Great <laughs> well job. Done, that was fun. That was a good game. I think the only thing that would happen if the game did carry on is I'd score a point here, which put me on to six. Yep. And then I'd move over here, try and kill them. And, and I'd miss a launch. Yeah. <laughs> and I'd potentially withdraw on that yeah. thing so you wouldn't get the extra points I would might have won. But that was fun. That was, that really was a game. lot of really fun. Enjoyed that. Yeah, that was that was heresy. That was 30k, Age of Darkness 2.0, Horus Heresy 2.0. Um, the new edition with the new rule books and the, the new Astartes and Heretic Loyalist extra books. Um, but yeah, you're yeah, obviously a heretic and stuff. Right? Yeah, you're an OG Heresy player. How did you find the new changes? Um, so I've only played a few games of OG Heresy, but mm. there are a few tweaks and stuff. For instance, um, Haywire. That's quite a big change because it can ignore invun saves and anything like that. Yeah, it's re it seems really strong does um, Haywire. The movement change is actually quite nice once you get used to it, and mm. the some of the special rules are exactly the same as Heresy 1.0. Yeah. Some of them have changed with some small tweaks. Rending, for instance, is still the same, yeah. but obviously the hay was different. Mm -hmm. But small tweaks, but overall I'd say it's just as enjoyable as Heresy 1.0, if not more. Yeah, I think it, as I, I haven't played Heresy for a long time. Now, so I've played a demo game, and this is like the first proper game I've had. Yeah, um, I really like the Legion rules. They seem really fun. They seem mm. really very, um, very flavorful. You know. Yes, I don't. I can see the strengths of them, and I can see people building to the strengths of the mm. lists. But obviously, that's what you'd expect. But it doesn't seem broken, as a lot of people have said. For instance, the Iron Hands one. Yes, it's very nasty against bolters, but against everything else, it doesn't matter. Yeah, so. against everything else, it doesn't really matter, and I mean, it mean, it will not die as nice on dreadnoughts. It sounds uh, yeah. really good, obviously, because the minus well, one strength get it. is really good. Well, the minus one strength you get, yes. Yeah, because um, obviously vehicles get it will not die. Everything else gets minus one strength from range weapons. Well, you seem to get it will not die because you just roll sixes, but no, exactly. And you can make it better. You can upgrade them to give them it will not die six up, and then the legion will makes it five plus, which is cool. Would you say the Spartan was worth its points? Um, he was pretty good, I think. I didn't take it this game just because of stuff we had, but I think Flare Shield is like auto take yeah, on him. Yeah, Flare Shield reduce. for the 50 points. So then he's minus one strength and he's, um, it got him on die as well. Yeah. Which seems really strong. So the Spartan was really good and he's a big distraction as well because he's just like, he can kill the really heavy infantry quite easily. Mm. He like really dealt with the Terminators. He was bullying the Dreadnought. Now, I didn't really deal with the Dreadnought. He kind of just, he was a bit of a train, but yes. mine was also a train over here. That's why I deployed him so far away, because I knew you'd put your Dreadnought into my Dreadnought. Well, we played a little practice game beforehand, and we just had a little Dreadnought v Dreadnought thing. We went, oh, I've only done one wound to you. Then we realized what Brutal did. Yeah. And that is very tasty. Brutal's role. really good. The, the Dreadnought seem, as as most people have realized, the Dreadnought seem really strong. Yeah. Like really, really strong. Yeah. Um, because they're so tough, they're hard to deal with. You can't, you can't one shot them with a melter gun anymore. Um, and then brutal coming in in combat is really really tough. So yeah. I think I think I think it's a really fun game. Obviously it's very narrative driven, which is nice. And special characters, for instance, Lucius. Lucius was good. Lucius yeah, is scary. Lucius That's why he's so good. far away from my army. Yeah. <laughs> of what's left of it anyway. Um, is this the norm? <laughs> what, three, <laughs> two models. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so like the special characters feel fun. And it, as someone said to me the other day, like. 40k is like competitive and narrative. Mm. Age Sigma is competitive and Heresy is very narrative driven. Heresy is very narrative. Yeah, it was. I, I can see it having the competitive element, and it's nice that they haven't sort of slapped Eternal Warrior on characters, which means they're immune to the double, um, the to the instant death, death yeah. bits and pieces. So Lucius hasn't got that, mm -hmm. so he can still be countered quite easily. But... Yeah, yeah. It's basically if I yeah. if I shoot if I shot them early on instead of the Terminators, maybe 
or he got to lose this area because mm. he really he killed both my characters, which obviously, yes. which he well, that's what he does. Uh, it's what he does. It's fluffy as so, well. So. Yeah, it was really fun, and this board was really cool as well. It's really nice. It's a nice change of pace, George. Yeah, well, I'm I'm glad you enjoyed uh, slapping up some marines as well. So yeah, good fun. So maybe I need to add to the iron hands because obviously the other ten marines are um, still here in the bag. <laughs> The other 10 marines are still here. Maybe I need to paint up some That's more. Good transport that. Yeah, exactly. You can carry 26 and 10 umbra unbuilt. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've got got another box. So I've got like another contempt coming as well. And then maybe a Kratos who spawned. Yeah, I'm looking and, forward to getting some Mark Sixes as well. Yeah, I think I'm probably just going to build all Dreadnoughts because they just seem better than... Yeah, well, you can run a, a list of just Dreadnoughts now as well, can't you? Yeah. So, so yeah, I wonder what Mikey's going to be running. As an Iron Hands player, as a narrative Iron Hands player, I'm just going to play Dreadnoughts. And how much have you always loved Leviathans, Mikey? I do love Leviathans, and now they've just announced <laughs> the plastic one as well, so oh, it's going to be fun. Well, there you go, George. Thank you very much for the game. Thank that you was very really much. fun. Guys at home, thank you much for watching. Hope you enjoyed Heresy 2.0. Uh, Empress Children vs. Iron Hands. Very narrative, of course. Very, very narrative. And shout out to the Johnsonator on Instagram for painting the Emperor Children for me. Yeah, they look mint, so shout out to him. Uh, there's a link to his Instagram in the description. And um, that's it. Thanks, George. Thank you very much. Bye, George. Bye, Mikey. Bye, chat. Love you. Bye. Bye. Please stop rolling sixes, Mikey.